Hi everybody, this is Felicia and I'm here today with a layout using a cut file that I do not know where it came from. <laughs> so I apologize in advance. <laughs> so what I'm doing is I'm going to be scrapping this photo. This is a photo that I took of my daughter. Um, these are graduate photos and I decided to go ahead and take my own photos this year because I have in the past I have left it up to other photographers to do it you know these big companies and stuff and they do a lousy job sorry that's my opinion but they do um, so I decided to go ahead and do my own photos this year and I did a whole bunch of them so now I'm pulling off this cut file here and like I said I have no I have cut files that I do not know where they came from usually nine times out of ten that means they came from Studio Calico so I'm kinda maybe right on that in right there but I love this cut file and I use the um, let's see let's see I use Paige Evans paper um, both of them to do this layout here so there's gonna be two um, pattern papers that I'm using on here so there is that cut file and I love the way that looks oh my gosh it looks so cool it almost looks like um, what's that game their video game I'm dating myself Miss Pac-Man <laughs> That's what it looks like to me so anyway so now I'm gonna get a lot of this ephemera um, from the Vicki Booten and um, I tell you I really like her um, ephemera packs I mean they're really nice and then I'm also gonna be using um, some chipboard here and um, a bunch of uh, puffy stickers from Bella Boulevard so right now I'm gonna get started with trying to glue this down here in my uh, nozzle is clogged so I finally get it unclogged so I had to cut that part out because it took me a little bit to get that unclogged and now I'm going to go ahead and glue my photo down here of my daughter now I have a whole bunch of photos of her for her graduation um, before her graduation photo so um, I definitely will be scrapping some more once I get the opportunity and now I'm gonna put this tag down I finally put some uh, for those of you who cannot stand putting tags on their pages without any um, what you call that there uh, any twine uh, I put some in there because <laughs> I know there were some people who don't like that so I put some in there and it's not that I don't like it it's just that I forget I forget to put the twine in there and so I definitely put some in there this time so those little cute little puffy stickers from Bella Boulevard of, of, of the flowers are really pretty, you guys. I really like those. So I had to find a reason to use them, and this is the reason that I have. Um, so now if you look at that sash around her neck there, it says Sac State, and it says A. Young. Okay, her, A is her, um, her initial for her first name, and last name is Young. And then um, she made that. She made her own sash. And um, I was really impressed on how well she did that. I mean, it was really nice. And then if you look closely there, you see on her neck she has two honor cords. She has uh, double honors. And then the, the um, what you call it, around her neck there, the, um, what do they call that? Oh, my gosh. She, anyway, um, the blue emblem there I would say or whatever that is see I get brain freezes <laughs> that's around her neck is part of her um, honor society that she belongs to um, so she did really well and I'm really proud of her so she now has her BA and we're extremely happy for her so uh, let's see so now I am cutting some paper and I decided that I needed to put a little bit of pattern paper there on the side to give it some interest and so that's what I did with that I just cut that piece and I put it over there um, just tucked it in there really good there on the side of the photo to give it some interest and it worked so oh, you have to pardon that dog that dog has been getting on my nerves it's a neighbor's dog and it just constantly barks they leave it out all the time so you have to pardon that so now I am going to start putting down my sprinkles and I'm using some of the Heidi Swap black velvet and that kind of brings out a little bit of the pink. I love how this pink is like ombre background pattern paper. This is awesome and I think that is the Paige Evans number 14. I can't remember which one but both of these pieces here, the pattern piece I cut, did the cut file on and the background are both from Paige Evans. 
So I'm just dabbing up a little bit of the excess and I am just about done with this layout. This layout was pretty quick and I just wanted to showcase my daughter in this pretty background paper and that is it. So I want to thank you guys for watching and be sure to tune in for more videos. Take care guys. Bye bye.